that OCD Imagine is like a record player where the needle keeps jumping back to the same groove. It's this recursive loop and traditional treatments try to lift the needle carefully, whereas psilocybin is more like briefly liquefying the vinyl itself. And when it re-solidifies, the um, obsessive grooves are still there, but then no longer captures the needle with the same inevitability. Psychedelics, they seem to create windows of neuroplasticity where the real change becomes possible. Neuroplasticity is the brain's ability to change, to learn, to adapt, and to form new pathways. And psychedelics aren't the only thing that can do this. Meditation can do it, running can do it. Anything that pushes the mind beyond its usual rhythm forces the brain to grow. So instead of targeting one specific illness, neuroplasticity supports the entire system. And that's part of why psychedelics are so promising they open up a window where the brain becomes more flexible, more open to change, and more capable of making meaning.